Hello, I'll talk about my balaclava. Okay, it is a balaclava, a ski mask. And why does this improve your pool game? It is because of the black, black borders around the eyes, which will block the light coming from the side, okay? So when you are aiming, you are aiming the shot. You are aiming the shot like this, the black around the eyes uh, you, you avoid getting light into your eye from the side and you only see you only see the light from the front you see and the light from uh, here it is blocked by the black border of the balaclava and you, you will get a tunnel vision and a tunnel vision is important for pool because then you will get into stroke you will get into the zone with the balaclava so the balaclava will bring you into the zone where you only see the shot and you you, you don't see the surroundings around you you see so this is why, why a balaclava is very useful for your pool game okay very useful you see here here i I shoot the shot, I aim, I don't see my surroundings because the surroundings are very distracting especially in the pool hall when people walk around you it is very distracting they walk past you and you see them but with the balaclava on the balaclava it's, it protects uh, the edges it, it, it blocks the edges of your uh, vision so you so you get a tunnel vision instead of uh, being distracted by things happening around you okay so this this is why the balaclava will get you into the zone and you you will play much better pool with the balaclava so th there are some uh, these were the pros uh, and now I will talk about the cons pros and cons the bad thing with the balaclava is that it becomes too hot so if you if you live in a hot uh, country maybe the balaclava is not for you okay maybe it is not for you if it's too hot but if you live in a cold country the balaclava is amazing okay and if your country doesn't even sell a balaclava then then it, then it means that your country is too hot to begin with okay but if you live in a cold country and you see that the stores are selling balaclava in the winter then you should buy one and use it for your pool game use it in the pool hall but maybe you need a permission permission to, to use it in the pool hall and in the tournament so if you want to use the balaclava in a tournament you need to ask the tournament director for permission to use the, the balaclava in a, in a tournament and uh, at first I, I, I just went to try the balaclava I, I, I wasn't expecting anything okay wasn't expecting anything and I mean, when having a beard it is very, di this, uh, very difficult to keep the beard inside the balaclava it will hang out often so you need to uh, you need to be aware of that if, if, you have a, if you have a beard but the, the good thing with the balaclava is that it, it, will, it will hold the beard tight here so if, if the beard is sticking beard is sticking out maybe it's not consistent for your pool game uh, but if you if you have a balaclava the beard will be held held in place okay but uh, for me I really liked having the beard touching the queue, especially with the house queue, because with the, with a two two piece queue, the beard will get stuck into the joint when you shoot, but not with a house queue. Okay, the beard does not get stuck into the joint because it, this is a one piece queue. the the house queue The house queue is a one piece queue, 
so that is why it is amazing for uh, people with a beard and you often see uh, many bar players with the long beards many bikers they use house cues in a pub and that, that is why because the beard works very good with the house cue okay and uh, yeah so uh, the, the, the pros I thought that I talked about the pros and the, and the cons and the cons the con is that one, one negative thing is that the beard will stick out but it really doesn't it really doesn't matter for me I still play very good and I, I, at first when, when I got the balaclava I, I didn't expect anything okay but I was very surprised that I was in the zone ran five racks five racks and within a few minutes five racks run with the balaclava I was very surprised why why did I run so those many racks and then I started to think uh, maybe this balaclava will improve on something and it improves it blocks the light around the eyes and I will get into the zone and I was in the zone when I ran those five racks and that is amazing and amazing how the balaclava can make you get into the zone okay I was very surprised there so uh, the good thing is that it blocks the no blocks the light, holds the beard. Uh, very good if you have a two two piece cue, so the beard does not get stuck into your cue when you stroke. It has happened to me many times, and it, it is it is very painful, very painful when the beard gets stuck in the in the joint, and you ah the beard follows. Okay, very painful, and. Uh, so I really don't see any, any negative, uh, negative things with the balaclava, only that it's, it's a little too hot, little too hot, but you don't play pool that long anyway, okay, if you play a match, you play a tournament match, maybe one hour or two hours, it is really not a big deal, you remove the balaclava between your matches, of course, of course, otherwise it is too hot, so your face has a chance to cool down now maybe you go outside uh, outside you go out from the pool hall you remove the balaclava you get some fresh air you cool down your face you go back into the pool hall for your next match okay your next match and uh, you need you need to get permi permission otherwise they will think there's a robber coming to rob the place so I recommend you go into the pool hall without the balaclava on and then you put it on when you play the match okay that is very very good advice here so the police doesn't come and and take you away from the tournament you want to be in the tournament and play and win the tournament so I really think uh, people the, the tournament director should re really allow the usage of a balaclava one because it blocks the light around the eyes and two because it holds the beard tight and three three because it is like a glove for your chin okay i forgot to tell you about this this is very good it is like a glove for the chin very good look how smooth look how smooth oh yeah i can feel it i can feel so smooth and here smooth in the glove smooth in the glove smooth in the chin this is a very very good fabric here very smooth fabric it glides very good if you if you if you have the cue touching the chin then we, without the beard it is very sticky very sticky without the beard and with the, be the the beard actually makes the stroke smoother okay smoother if you have your cue touching the chin okay very very smooth here very smooth but the balaclava is even better even better it is like uh, a pool glove for your chin pool glove for your chin oh so smooth very smooth very smooth so the balaclava is very good in, in both of those ways uh, you could of course use some kind of a mask that will cover the eyes you can use a mask only to cover the eyes uh, but then you don't have the, the fabric on your chin for, for your cue stroking you don't have the fabric for your chin 
So that's why the balaclava has uh, two, two purposes, two in one, for eyes and the cheek, okay? So that is the end of my video. Subscribe to my channel. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.